Hello and welcome to my channel. Today I will show you the process from sketch to the final design. I will create an illustrator, Kid Goku in his Ultra Instinct form. You don't need advanced drawing skills. Just a quick drawing to serve as a template for your project. 3. 2. 1. Process starting. Let's create a new document. Make it 840 by 600 pixels in color mode RGB. Rename your document as the current project. To import your sketch, go to File and Place. Click and drag it, and set it in the middle of your canvas. I had to make another sketch, because I wasn't too happy about the first one. Double-click on the layer thumbnail. Rename it Sketch, and check the template box. This will automatically dims the picture to 50 percent and locks the layer. Create a new layer. Select the pen tool. Select no fill and change the stroke to black. Make sure to check the round cap and round join boxes. Click once and then set another point by clicking and drag. You can hold, command or control, to refine the anchor points. Select it and now choose the reflect tool. Click while holding, Option or Alt, to copy it. Select both shapes. Now go to Object, Path, and select Join. Let's continue the project in the same way using the Pen tool. Select and drag the Live widget to refine your shape. Select the overlapping strokes, and go to Shape Builder tool. Then, while holding Option or Alt, click once to delete the unnecessary pieces. Remember, the sketch is just a guide, you don't have to trace the lines exactly like in the picture. Select the Curvature tool. Then click and drag. Make sure to activate the smart guides when needed. Sorry about that. After a senzu bean, I am back at 100%. So far, so good. Group it and make a copy on the side in case you need to make adjustments later on. 
create a new layer and name it color. Click this button and drag it in the color layer while pressing Option or Alt. Now lock this layer. Press Shift plus M to select the Shape Builder tool. Choose a fill and click on the desired shapes. When you're done, select all created new shapes while holding Shift. Press Command or Ctrl X to cut them from the artboard. Hide this layer. Funny, looks like Krillin now. Let's delete Krillin, as we are creating Goku now. Paste it back in place, using Shift and Command or Ctrl, plus V. Search on Google for a picture. So you can extract the desired colors for your shapes. Using the eyedropper tool. Well done. Put your sketch on the side, as reference. I am applying now different stroke weights, for a better harmony of the character. Select the Width tool. Now click and drag in the middle for a thicker or thinner stroke. Then close up the sides. This way you will have a nicer effect in the final result of your project. Continue so we've done earlier. Make a new layer above the color 1, and name it Shadows. Select two shapes like this. Click once on the desired one, using the Shape Builder tool. And delete the X's. Select one of the shapes. Then go at, select, same, fill color. This will select all shapes with the same fill color. This way is quicker to reduce the opacity of all in the same time. For the highlights, I am choosing white fill, then reducing the opacity as desired. Let's do some deeper shadows, for a more dramatic effect. Add some highlights here.
I will add now the energy particles for a better effect. Go to Effect menu, then Blur, and choose Gaussian Blur. Drag another copy on the side, just in case you need to make small adjustments. This is the color I choose for his eyes. Apply again Gaussian Blur for this stroke using this setting. Use Smooth Tool for a better curve. OK, now create a background using the Rectangle tool. Select everything and expand. Now open Pathfinder and select Merge. Copy your character and paste it on a new layer, underneath it. Unite the copied character in the Pathfinder tool. Now go to Object, Path and Offset Path. Set joins to round. Change the color using this code. Apply here also as before, Gaussian Blur, with this setting. Lower opacity. Group everything, and set it in the middle of the artboard. Project complete. Congratulations! If you made it until here, don't forget to like, subscribe and turn on the notifications bell so we can meet again. Thank you and see you around.